seven. Now we have five different numbers that are ten and less. Let's see if you know them. Four, ten, two, eight, six. Now let's look at these five numbers and can you find a pattern? Great job! Very, very well done! Our pattern is that these are even numbers. Now let's put our even numbers in order from smallest to biggest. Are you ready? Let's go! 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Great job! So what do you see? I can see a pink candy. Can you? Great! What do you see now? I can see three groups of candy. Which one has seven candies? Let's count. Group one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Group one has seven. Group two has one, two. Group three has one, two, three. That means group one has seven candies. Group one has seven candies. Let us write the number seven. We write the number 7 by going straight and then down. Straight and then down. Straight and then down. How do we spell the number 7 in words? S-E-B-E-N spells 7. This is how we write the number 7. Let us practice. Here we have two circles with crayons in them. Let's count how many crayons are there in each circle. Which circle has seven crayons? Circle number one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Circle number one has six crayons. Circle number two has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That means our answer is circle number two. Circle number two has seven crayons. Let's match and say. Here we have two groups of flowers. One that's red and one that's pink. We also have two numbers. Our numbers are 7 and 4. So let's count the flowers, match and say the words. 1, 2, 3, 4. There are 4 red flowers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. There are 7 Pink flowers. Let us write seven. This is how we write seven in words. S E V E N S E V -E E N And this is how we write the number 7 in numbers. Straight and down. Straight and down. Until next time, goodbye.